This is Red's Busy, 60 over 7. She's an April 23rd. <clears throat> Red's Busy is a rebel red daughter out of Crown Dixie that you saw earlier. She has a beautiful fielder heifer with her. We'll show you her in a minute. She's kind of hiding behind mom. Fielder heifer number 51, born April 22nd. This is that fielder heifer. Look at the horn coming on this heifer. With all the horn mama has, plus fielder adding to it, great pair. This is Red Shadow, another Rebel Red Daughter, born March of 05. Red Shadow is out of a cow named Flying Shadow. Great body, beautiful color, and a world of horn. We'll get in front of her here so you can see how much horn she has. Red Shadow. This cow has a lot of horn. We put her with Bubba to flatten that horn out. They're doing total horn measurement as well as tip to tip now, so the fact that she has so much total horn is greatly in her favor. This is her beautiful little Bubba heifer, number 41, an April 10 calf. We hope we get another one just like her. She gets prettier every day. This is Shoutin' Red, another rebel red daughter out of a cow we'll show you in a minute named Scream and Shout. Shoutin' Red is a March of 05. We lost her calf to the blizzard this year. Shoutin' Red. Look at the body on this sweet girl. Shoutin' Red. This is Shocking Ruby 605, 11 of 06, female by Shockwave, out of a cow named Ruby. This is her Bubba calf, number 211. We're gonna, we're gonna breed her back to Bubba. So she has another one just like this next year, but a heifer. Shocking Ruby and her Bubba Steer 211. This is Scream and Shout. She's a stealth daughter born in 96 out of a um, cow catcher daughter named Scream and Mimi. Her mama had 67 inches of horn and could do a circle in the trailer in less than one minute's time six times. This is her beautiful little black heifer, number 66, sired by Bubba, born May 11. We hope she has another one just like this one by Bubba. Look at the frosting on her face. Another perfect uttered cow, 14 years old, raising a calf, doing everything she's supposed to do. Love these Texas Longhorns. Scream and shout. This is Starheart, owned by Dean and Mary Horky, a beautiful unbreakable daughter out of Rebel Snitz, Rebel Red uh, Super Snitzel. Starheart lost her calf in the blizzard this year too. Anybody who doesn't think Unbreakable can throw horn ought to look at this girl. Starheart being bred back to Bubba. This is, she's showing you how cow longhorns help you meet ends financially. <laughs> She's gonna use those horns for one of their many purposes. Starheart is a March of 05 female. This is Super Shadow 7 over 7. She's a Superman daughter out of Shadow's Imp owned by H&J. Super Shadow will be bred to Bubba to lower the horn, she has a bucket load of it, and add more spots to her. Super Shadow. This is Top Shadow, 47 over 7. She's born April of 07 and is sired by Top Brass, who is a uh, Rebel Red uh, son of RCC Moolah. She's out of a cow we'll see named Snuggles Shadow. Top Shadow has a beautiful, unbreakable bull calf here born April 20th, number 138. We'll get him up and let you look at him. Another beautiful bodied black and white. These black and white sell all the time for first calf heifer fresheners. We'll keep him as a bull. This is Top Fawny. She's a March of 07, sired by a bull named Top Round, out of a cow named Snooky. This is, she has a beautiful little Bubba heifer number 36, with speckles and spots all over her. And this is the kind of cow 
economically priced that'll make you money bred to a bull like Bubba, Top Fawny and her Bubba Heifer. This is Tempting Cowgirl. She's one of the ranch favorites by far. Born March of 98. She's a cowboy man daughter. Out of Effective Temptation, who was an effective daughter, which is Overwhelmer, Texas Ranger. Look at the body on her. And look at her pretty heifer. This heifer, number 40, was born April 10th, sired by Bubba. We'll get her out so you can see her a little better. Another one of our older cows with perfect udders raising big fat calves. Look at this pretty little frosty color and the horn coming on with her. Number 40, tempting cowgirl Bubba. This is Trump Snuggles. She's a May 16th of 02 model, sired by Trump, who is a great big gruya, silver and white bull. Trump Snuggles is out of a cow named True Heart Snuggles. Trump Snuggles has a uh, Billy Bob in her pedigree, and this gruya color is very unusual, very unique. Trump Snuggles. Well, now we'll show your bull. This is her little rebel red calf, number 166. We're breeding her to Bubba to get a little more color. This little calf, number 152, is sired by a Superman son. Here he is, 152, sired by Superman 2, born April 25th. He will go in our meat program. This is twice shy, the dam of that calf, out of a cow named Firefly, who had very high twist horns like this cow. She's sired by Rebel Red. We're giving her to Bubba to make more color twice shy. Again, another great bodied cow, twice shy being bred to Bubba to lower the horns and color up the red. Number 163, out of a cow we're going to show you named Vivid, sired by Bubba. He's just a May 11th and has the size of some of our March babies. Number 163, you're looking at a future herd sire here. And this is the dam of that calf, Vivid Reflection. Look at the lateral corkscrew twist on this female's horns. She's in uh, November 1st of 1996. Her sire is Troubadour. Troubadour was the bull that American Breeders Service chose over all the bulls available to collect and distribute semen nationally and internationally uh, on Longhorn uh, first calf heifer freshener buyers. She's out of a cow named Vivid. Look at the body on this cow. Vivid won the world uh, many years ago. And this is the kind of cow we wish we had a pasture full of. That's it for this pasture. We are now in King Rio's pasture. We put a real variety with him. Blacks, reds, high horns, low horns, lot of horn, little horns. <coughs> Hey, I'm talking. And he's coming through the trees here. You'll see him in just a minute. King Rio is a JP Rio grandson. JP Rio Grand is known for throwing horn on his progeny. This young guy is a May of 07. He's out of a cow we showed you in Rendezvous Pasture named Crown Princess. You can see uh, Rio Grande has certainly put some horn on him. Long-bodied young guy. We have a few calves on the ground sired by him from last year's breeding, and they've all been black or black and white speckled and spotted. King Rio. This is 10 over 9, Panda's Red by The Shadow. Panda's Red is a cow we saw in Bubba's pasture. We are hoping that he will throw black or black and white with this sweet little heifer that will eat out of your hand. 10 over 9.